Hackers are terrible people, but did you know that some of your Roblox YouTubers who are your favorites are also hacking? Today in this video, I'll be going over 10 Roblox YouTubers who got exposed for hacking. Welcome back to Blocks Flow, let's get into the video. Number 10, Magpie. You may already know about this YouTuber and what you may not know is that he hacked into many of his fans' accounts. And that became clear when one of these fans called him out on this. The fan Jeremy said that he had clicked on the free Robux giveaway that Magpie had mentioned in his YouTube video. And after that he was hacked and his Robux was stolen and many other fans lost a lot of their Robux too. That's what he was reported by many and was later blocked from Here's Roblox. Him. I guess if you're going to get trolled by a hacker, this is probably one of the best trolls that there is, but it sucks because it is unfortunate. Number 9, Zay Let's Play. She is quite a popular YouTuber with over 2 million subscribers, and she is well known for playing Roblox. But she did more than just play Roblox, she also happened to hack it, and not so discreetly may I add. In one of her videos, she is seen hacking into her sister's account on Roblox, and then after which she proceeds to read all her messages. And even though it may only be your sister, this is still not a good thing to do, and that is why many fans call her out on this particular act. Yeah. <laughs> Just something really casual, and then maybe like a nice crop top with some jeans or something. Let's see what we can- Number 8, Flamingo. This is the same Flamingo you, the famous one you probably know from YouTube. He too has hacked into someone's Roblox account, and that someone happened to be his girlfriend. To be fair, she was the one who hacked him first, and that must be why he decided to hack her in her turn, and then use up all the Robux. The plan seemed like a good one, but when he did log into the account, he found only one Robux there, so I guess her girlfriend was smarter than what he had thought. So I'm, get I'm getting a- it's like targeted ads. I'm getting an ad directly about me. So I, <laughs> I joined this game called State View, which you've probably seen that game before. It's- Number 7, Fox Kirsten. So I had mentioned in the previous name Flamingo that he only hacked because his girlfriend hacked him. So it seems fair that the next name I introduced is his girlfriend's name, who has an account called Fox Kirsten. So she had outwitted him and when he had tried to hack her. But what was more impressive was that she made a video on her YouTube page that was done especially to show that she hacked into his account. And uh, she also showed that she played many Roblox games under his character. Uh. Oh my god. Is this you? No. Is this you? No. I'm over by the, I'm over by, uh, the lettuce. Number six. Flamelex. Many people try to gain an audience by unfair means, and that is what this person did. With only a few subscribers to support him, he decided to do something about that by going on Roblox and making a game that was called Subscribe to Flamelex. Yep, you heard it right. But of course, there is nothing wrong with making a game. It is, however, a lot wrong in hacking Roblox, so that he can make it look like he had over 10,000 players who were playing the game when they weren't. Number 5, Mr. Black. He is a very small YouTuber that only had 2,500 subscribers, and when you go look at his videos, you will notice that most of his videos are themed around as hacking videos. In some videos, he has seen hacking into multiple Roblox games, and one video that stands out among the others is a video in which he hacked Prison Life. That video managed to make more than 300,000 views on YouTube. Number 4, Zeph Plays. Yes, he too did not do hacking exactly, but he has done a few hacking trolls on his channel. One of them was a video he uploaded, in which he made up an alternative account. He gave the account the admin powers, and then he acted like it was hacking when he was not. He was just using the admin command feature in Roblox that can sometimes be mistaken as hacking. Maybe he was just having some fun by freezing people, but it must have been annoying for some people, because many of them went ahead and reported them as well. Number 3, Ant. Yes, it is really surprising to see his name on this list, but it is true he has hacked into Roblox. It may not seem like a big deal when I tell you he has hacked into his friend's account. One particular person is Poke. In a video, he was having some issues with his account, and at first he just assumed someone was trolling him. The hacker later messaged him that I am in your house. He was worried, but he assumed it was one of his roommates. And though at first no one admitted it when he later went on to Ant's room, he caught him red-handed logging into his account. Number 10, Ash of the Unicorn. You associate hacking with bad things, of course, but what Ash of the Unicorn's intention was when she had hacked into someone's account was to help out the person. So what happened was that she hacked into one of her fans' accounts so that she could leave them some more Robux and thought this was a very sweet gesture. The way she had performed it was not that nice. She could have approached him differently and offered them the Robux then. But still considering her intention, I think it's not that bad. Number 1, Dennis. Now this YouTuber did not hack anyone or pretend like he had hacked someone. Instead, he took a different approach. He pretended that he got hacked by someone, that his account was compromised, it was later found out that it was just a joke. But still, the audience was not aware of this joke, so that makes this prank that he pulled off a bad thing. So he may not have necessarily hacked into anyone, but he still did something that should be considered bad. This brings us to the end of our video. I hope you enjoyed it. Hit like if you did, and don't forget to subscribe to our channel so you don't miss out on any of our videos in the future. Also, watch the two videos that are on your screen, because I'm sure you'll love them. With that, I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.